What up, nation? We're over here testing a Verizon millimeter wave node, and it is performing like crap. And I'm really, really hoping a Verizon engineer might be watching this video so they could tend to this problem. My location is Lorraine Road in North Olmsted over at the Dunkin' Donuts from across the street between the self-storage and the Metro Toyota or whatever this Toyota dealership is called, Sunnyside. I forget. Anyways, the node's like in and out, not really connecting well. I'm line of sight. It's across the street. It's literally a block away. All right, 779 down, 65 up. I'm going to go ahead and run another test. And this time I want to take a look at the configurations here. Okay, we're finally picking it up there. Band 13 for 10 megahertz. There's your LT anchor. And there's N260, 100 megahertz. And we've got eight component carriers, right? So tons of bandwidth. Not really performing great. And actually, when I was just testing it a second ago, before I started recording, it was getting like... I don't know, like 300 down and then all the way down to like 20 megs because it was like on band 13 only. All right, so 1.4 gigs down, 54 up. Not great for millimeter wave, honestly. Um, yeah, I'm in a car. Yeah, there's glass. Whatever the hell that's supposed to mean, but it's not really performing well. I have no clue what's going on with that thing. Typical speeds for millimeter wave with that bandwidth configuration. I mean, we're talking three, four gigs down. Right, so I don't know what's going on. Uh, it's definitely not acting right. It's not behaving like it should be, not performing well. Here's 1.5 gigs down and 65 up. Pings look good. You know, I wouldn't say it's anything concerning, but just the just the raw capacity and throughput. It's just not what I thought it was going to be. Um, and I'm not really sure as to why. I don't know. I mean, I can get those speeds on C-band, you know what I'm saying? With, you know, basically 200 megahertz of bandwidth on mid-band and LTE, you know? So that's not, that's not millimeter wave worthy, you know? I don't know. It's weird. It's a really, really weird situation. It's, uh, it's got me confused. And I'm not really sure what, what this is, what the business is. Uh, look, it disconnected it again. All right, now we're back to band 13 only. Uh, look, and then you got the ping spike. See that 275? Jitters in the 70s. There's something wrong with this node. It's just not functioning properly. And I think because it's probably a low usage node, I mean, it's pointing at the Toyota dealership. Um... <laughs> Or whatever, self-storage, whatever, wherever it's pointing at. The other node, I think, is pointing down a neighborhood street. Which, of course, is probably cool, right? Like, some of those folks can get the 5G home and air if they want. I'm guessing AT&T Fiber is there, right? And, and whatever. But um, not ideal. I'm, I'm not a fan of this. Kind of hoping that a Verizon engineer is watching this. I know that the engineers from the big telco companies watch my content. They're always observing what I'm doing here. So, hey, if that's the case, take a look. See what you could do. You know, see if you could figure it out. I don't know if it's a bug. I don't know if something's wrong. Uh, but I think it's worth a look. Uh, yeah, so we'll we'll see. I'll come back and test this another day. But it's, it's just not what I'm accustomed to from Verizon's Millimeter Wave. I expect, you know, excellence and stuff like that, so... Definitely subpar. But uh, give this video a like and a share, folks. Drop me a comment. How's the Verizon Millimeter Wave performing in your market? What kind of speeds you see in? This is Samsung Radio Gear, just so you guys know the old stuff, right? When they first started installing Samsung radios after the Nokia debacle. Anyways, thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe for more. Come back for more videos. Watch another one. There's some right here at the end. Uh, check those things out. And uh, subscribe if you're new. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload from this channel. We'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.